Hey there everybody, welcome back to another Global Courses tutorial and in today's video we're going to be learning all about animations. This will be a step-by-step -step guide, so don't worry if you're completely new to animations because by the end of today's video you'll be a complete pro. Let's go ahead, let's get started and make sure if you're finding these videos helpful, make sure to like and subscribe. Now as soon as you have Roblox Studio open, the first thing that you have to do, let's go to File and let's save to Roblox. Let's give it a name. I'll call this Animation Test. Click Save and then just give it some time so for it to save. This shouldn't take too long. Once the game is saved, let's go to Avatar and let's add a rig builder. For the rig type, there are two different types. There's the R15 or the R6. For today, we want to choose the R15 because it has more moving parts. And then choose the block Avatar. There it is. Once you have the avatar, let's call him, I'll call this Bob. And for my students, they know who Bob is. Now let's click on the on Bob over here. Let's click on animation editor. Once we have the animation editor open, let's give it a name. And in this case, I will be having a waving animation. So I'll just call it wavy. Once that's done, what I want you to do is think how you wave. So usually you raise your hand and start moving your hand as well. So let's click on the shoulder. As soon as you click on the shoulder, all that I want you to do is rotate it a bit. This won't make any difference. Rotate it a bit and place it back where it was. And this will create your very own keyframe. Once that's done, you can click on the blue line and move it a bit. Once you move the blue line, let's create another keyframe. And this time around, Bob will raise his hand up. All the way up. There we go. If we test it out like this, we can click the play button and it does look a bit funny. We can even click on the loop button and then play it again. So let's click on stop. Let's move the blue line a bit more. And what I want to do now is I want Bob to actually wave. The way that we're going to do this, I click on the blue circle over here and rotate the hand. That should be good. Let's move the blue line one more time and move it to the other side. Move the blue line, move it again. Move the blue line, place it back where it was, towards the start. There we go. Then move the blue line and then lower the hand back down. So now we can even test it out. There we go. Now if you see that it's going a bit faster than we want it, all that you have to do, click pause and move these keyframes, click on the blue diamonds and move them further away from each other. So I'll move this as far as I can. There we go. And make some extra space between all of these. And then test it out again. There we go. That looks good. Now, one more step that you have to do over here, click on the three dots. Before we publish to Roblox, we have to set animation priority. In this case, this will be movement. I click on movement and then let's publish to Roblox. Waving animation, click save. There we go, you can click close. Now, let's close the animation editor for now. I'll click on Bob, let's click plus and add a script. Now all of these scripts as always will be in the description and also in the comments. Don't forget you can also join the discord and you'll find all the scripts and you can ask as many questions as you want over there. But you just need to, over here you just need to copy and paste the script and then we need to find the animation ID. Otherwise it will not work. Now the fastest way to find your own animation ID, go to home, click on the toolbox, now go to the four boxes over here, this is your inventory, click it, instead of my models, go to plugins, sorry, go to my animations, and there it is, waving animation. Right click, copy the asset ID, and then you can paste it over here. Now all of the script, don't forget, it will be in the description. And what this will do 
it's going to play the, the animation every five seconds. So it's just going to play the animation, wait for five seconds, and then play it again. Let's see it work. <laughs> there is Bob waving, and there he is. Isn't that cool? Now, as always, thank you all for viewing. I'm very excited to see all of the games that you create. Make sure to leave a comment if you found the video helpful. And also, if there's something that you want me to do, leave it down in the, in the comments below. Thank you for viewing. Make sure to like and subscribe. This will help a lot the channel. See you all in the next one.